New tonight, Crossroads Mission overwhelmed by the number of undocumented immigrants showing up at the shelter's doorstep. For over two months, undocumented immigrants from Guatemala, Cuba, and Haiti are finding their way to the mission by foot, taxi, and even train cars. A representative of the mission says that 50 to 60 people show up each day and stay for at least five days before getting back in a, in a taxi or hopping on the train that passes right by the mission frequently. However, some camp out in front of the mission. As we have previously reported, the mission is quickly running out of resources, especially food, clothing, and blankets due to the sudden rise of the people in need. While Crossroads opens its doors for everyone, it is not equipped to handle large groups of undocumented immigrants. As of now, the shelter is feeding the large groups outside only and not providing shelter to them. Aside from not having resources for them, there are concerns over COVID and standard processing. Crossroads staff have told the undocumented immigrants to leave, but it is reported that some have become combative. As of this evening, Crossroads Mission has called Border Patrol and the Yuma County Sheriff's Office to help move the undocumented immigrants elsewhere and are still waiting for the Sheriff's Office to arrive.